Today's video is so fun because it is finally a thrift haul. I'm doing my first thrift haul of 2019 for you guys. It has been since August since I have done a real thrift haul for you. It has just not been conducive for our budget or for us to go out and go thrifting. But my husband and I went thrifting this past weekend and I have some things for maternity, for the nursery potentially, and at the end there is going to be a giveaway. So a giveaway for you lovely subscribers and supporters of my channel. I've never done a giveaway on my channel. Um, it's just an item I thrifted, but um, I think a decor piece that I think you guys will really enjoy. So stay tuned till the end so you can see how to enter to um, be part of the giveaway. But I'm just going to jump right in with the items I have found. So first thing I found was this Born Free, the Smart Glass Bottle. It was just a dollar, so I thought this would be um, something I might try. I want to use glass, I think, for my baby, so I'll use the plastic, of course, too, because that's just more convenient, but I'm like, being a dollar, I'll try it. If you've ever used this type of a bottle, let me know what you think about it, um, if it works or if it doesn't, and I thought for a dollar, I can't really go wrong, so. All right, I'm going to share some clothing items with you. The next item is a Simply Noel. And it is supposed to be a dress. It is kind of a navy-ish color. And then it has pockets. It probably will be a little tight on me right now, um, being that I have a larger belly, being pregnant and almost into my third trimester. So this will probably fit okay right now. Um, I think at Goodwill the tops are 425. I want to say that's what it was. So I think it'll be super cute. Um, I didn't try any of my clothes on. I just went with it. Even comes. All right, another top I am very excited about is this Philly Flare. It is a gray, um, almost like a vest, but is very long. It goes to my knees, and this will definitely last all the way through my pregnancy, through this winter. It has some little fun pockets on the front. Um, there is not, well, what material is it made of here? It's 100% polyester, so um, I'm okay, I guess, sticking it in the washing machine even, so it's, even though it says hand wash, but I've always wanted one of these. They'll go great with some skinny jeans for school. All right, last piece of clothing, some maternity dress pants. Again, I did not try them on, probably a fault there. Um, probably should have, but I don't have any maternity dress pants. I do like that it has the belly band that goes past my belly button. It's awful, I feel like, when they start to fall down, so having the belly band over my belly button um, is so great. And it is my size, they were from Old Navy originally, so I think these were also $4.25. Alright, a couple decor pieces. I don't know why I've been looking for decor, but I thought these might be fun to hang in our little baby girl's room. It is just a black um, metal, and this one says, This is the day that the Lord has made. Let us rejoice and be glad in it. Psalm 118.24. And it was $3, originally from... I think it's a Stupal Home Decor Collection, if you can see that there. I don't know where that is. But there's this one. And then there's this one. Be on your guard, stand firm in the faith. Be courageous, be strong, do everything in love. 1 Corinthians 16, 13 through 14. And this was $3 as well um, from the same place. So I will either use these in my baby's room or for something else, I'm not sure. But I thought they were super cute together um, and be fun to decorate with. All right, and then like I said, I kinda went with some decor. This is another piece, Praise God, from whom all blessings flow. Now this will definitely be going in our baby girl's room because it's kinda girly. I wanna do more neutral colors on the wall and the bedding and stuff than just have some like pops of color through signs. And this was $4. Um, it was from Hobby Lobby originally for 20 so I don't know if I overpaid, but Goodwill does not back down on their prices, which is kind of a bummer. But I think this is very cute, and it's got like the open back, so then it's pretty light and will hang well on a wall. 
Okay, the last piece I found is this creamer and it is the um, brand Stoneware Williamsburg made in Japan. It is a little bit dirty, but I'll clean it up. And this piece here is going to be my giveaway. Uh, I don't believe this is real ironstone, but I would love to give one of you, my subscribers, this cute piece of stoneware. And now how to enter for this giveaway. Today is Tuesday the 8th and this giveaway will close in one week. So when that closes, I will randomly select a subscriber who has, first thing you have to do, comment below and like this video. So you need to be a subscriber, you need to comment below, and you need to like this video. So to get this item, please do those things. I know many of you like decorating with this type of decor. It is very farmhouse, rustic, and I would love to share my thrifted finds with you guys. I want to be doing some more giveaways, especially when it's thrifted. So again, please do go comment below and like this video for thrift haul so that you can be entered into the giveaway and then I'll randomly select one from those who have commented below to win my stoneware piece. So that is it for my little first thrift haul of 2019. If you enjoy these type of videos, then please feel like subscribing. I do videos on simple and thrifted living, DIYs, and homemaking, and I'd really appreciate having you join my YouTube community. Don't forget to check out the description box too. I'll give details of how to enter for that giveaway as well. But with that, I hope you have a blessed and wonderful day. Talk to you in the next one. Bye.